Hi, my name is uh, Tomek and I am really leading the YouTube channel I am Programmer and I want to show you something like related to maybe not programming skills, uh, of course it's not programming skills, but something like let's say um, IT case and uh, one of the things is like paint.net, so many people ask me how to rotate the text which how to do it in a pain net? So that was the question. And uh, in order to answer that question, uh, maybe not to repeat myself, I decided to record it. It will be helpful for not only people who asked me, but also maybe for someone else. In the past, I also had to get to know it on my own. So now I will show you. So so this is the paint net, paint.net uh, 4.216 version. So how to make the text rotated, of course. In order to, to write text, here is like the, on the tools, uh, there is a text button. So if we we'll click it, we have it here. Let's make it a bit bigger. So here, let's make the font 26. Ah, OK, it will be visible. Calibri could be as a font. Okay, right, let's write, let's say something like sample text. OK, uh, here we wrote sample text. Let's put it in the middle. But now how to rotate it? Mm, here, as you can see, there are a lot of icons, but uh, none of them in the basic, uh, let's say, uh, bars is helpful. So we have to do it in a bit different way. So let's click outside. Okay, let, let's change it. Let's click here. This this icon. So move selected pixels. If you click here, uh, the whole layer will be uh, highlighted. Here you can have, have it. And then we have to aim here to the right corner, bottom, left, right, top or just outside, as you can see. Uh, the, the main and the best thing will be for you to, to remember, let's say, uh, bottom right corner. And then, as you can see, the indicator and the mouse indicator changed. And if you click the button, left mouse button, and move it up, we can move it as much as we want. So, for example, to make the uh, to make the uh, sentence or let's say the text upside down up uh, or from top to the bottom we can just move it here and release okay if we don't like it we want to move it a bit okay we can of course move it or just rotate it further so we can also go to the standard uh, starting point oh. of course now we need to go back here to the middle, and that will be that will be all. Or just using Control Z, uh, we are at the beginning. So as you can see, uh, it's I will say quite uh, quite easy and intuitive. So one more time, we wrote the text. We click here on the move selected pixels. We click it, and then we are going uh, outside of the let's say layer and the painting picture, painting uh, let's say uh, window, and then uh, the mouse our our uh, mouse pointer is changing into the arrows upside down and showing us uh, that it, the picture, mm, the selected area could rotate. So we click left mouse button and rotate and rotate as many times as you want. So I hope you enjoy it. That's a very simple function, uh, very useful at paint.net. Of course, like uh, I just showed it on the first one layer. But if you would like to, you could also play with other layers. So just rotate this part of text and add another one, rotate it in a different different way. Whatever you want to do, it could be done in paint.net. It's a free word. So below the, uh, below the video, there will be a link to download paint.net. So enjoy it. Bye-bye.